Lifting the truck up, spun it around instantly, and uh, as soon as it spun it around, I was floating. Now at 10, rising water in southeastern Wisconsin, drivers left stranded, and we count down to when we can start to dry out. And that's where we begin this evening, heavy rain and widespread flooding. And that has prompted warnings and even water rescues across our area. Weather expert Tom Walks has a look at just how much rain has fallen in the past two days. Almost afraid to hear this. Ben Handelman and Casey Cronus with the high waters that have overtaken several parts of our viewing area. Let's start with Casey. She is live tonight in Glendale. What's the story there, Casey? Well, Ted, the high river levels have stopped some onlookers in their tracks here in Kletch Park, taking a moment to capture it for themselves. Meantime, others not only captured the flooding, they were put right in the middle of it. Rushing water from the Milwaukee River rising to eye catching levels. It's crazy. There's not almost not a waterfall there. The sight brought Beverly Evans to a halt in Glendale's Clutch Park. Over on the other bank, they're into their yard and everything. The river, along with flooded soccer fields and swampy backyards, bearing the brunt of the rainfall on this parkway. This, of course, is my truck. Halfway underwater. But as heavy rain took over Root River Parkway in West Alice, Jonathan Ayupa found himself on an island all alone. I thought, no, this is not good. The Muskego man was venturing to an auto parts store on Sunday when all of the sudden. I looked to the left and there was mailbox sticking out of water just a little bit. And I looked to the right, the same thing. His wheels were no longer hitting the pavement. But I lifted the truck up, spun it around instantly. And uh, as soon as it spun it around, I was floating. And then water started coming in. This is Root River Parkway. Sitting atop his submerged SUV, Ayupa started recording. I was mostly scared. A neighbor noticing the trouble he was in was quick to dial 911. Well, these are the firemen that saved my life. Boat in tow, West Alice firefighters helped Ayupa to dry land, relieved that a close call didn't end differently. I'm very blessed. Very blessed. And last night, the Milwaukee River was observed to be past seven feet. That's flood stage. That came down a little bit today with the National Weather Service observing it to be at about six feet. Reporting live in Glendale, Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. Scary moments for him. Casey, thank you.